Just doing a quick video to show you how to modify your crampon straps uh, in order to make it easier to get them on and off without having to re-thread the strap through everything all the time. So the way to do this is first of all you need to put the boot in, do the straps up and check where you want velcro attaching to and how much of the strap you need to cut off. When you are cutting your strap down to length use some heated scissors using a gas hob or your camping stove in order to stop it from fraying. What I'll then do is, while it's on the boot, mark with maybe some chalk or something where you want the uh, the velcro. The main thing is make sure you don't, you don't put uh, the male velcro, you want the female velcro, the fluffy bit, on the end of the strap, like so. If you can machine it on with the machine that's better. This is hand sewn at the moment but I've just got a machine so I'm going to go over it again. And then Again, a longer piece, that's a short piece, um, you know, two and a half, three inches long. And then you want a longer piece because sometimes, you know, different, if you've got different boots as well, it could land in a different, slightly different spot. So do the male Velcro near the end of the strap. Uh, make that longer so you've got a bit of um, leeway, bit, you know, bit of uh, clearance there. And then what you want to do is, best thing first to do is to do it while you're on the boot, but because the boot will get in the way so I'll just show you what I'll do. So you just feed it through at home while you're at home in the comfort and warmth of your own home. You're not wearing big bulky gloves. Just do that. Play, thread it as normal through the, uh, the buckle just so that the velcro's through. But what you do now is you just leave it like that and when you're ready to uh, step in into the crampon it's nice and slack so you can get your foot in Step forward, clip your boot on, off the crampon onto the boot, and it's on. All you've got now to do is to pull this end of the strap, make sure you've got it nice and tight. Obviously you'll be, you'll be okay doing this with, uh, with mitts and stuff on. The only bit of feeding you have to do is through there, but there's quite a gap there on the plastic bale. So you just pull it up, pull it through. Back through there where you've just put that one, and then you've got when you've threaded it the, the right way around. Which, if you've got the boot in it, you will thread it the right way around properly. You just press the velcro down. Contrary to popular belief, the velcro doesn't actually fill up with snow and ice. What you know, once you've got it on, as long as you've pressed it down, you've got good quality velcro. Buy good quality velcro, don't scrimp. If you're going to do this, you might as well do it properly. And job done. And there you go, a lot easier. And then all you have to do then when you want to take the uh, tampons off is pull it through, pull your little tab, slack, and all you're doing is slacking in the strap off, you're not taking it out. So slacking it off, leaving the velcro in there, pull it through. Now what I do is I actually use this, it's a bit difficult, you don't want to break these adjustments here on the uh, clip. So I use the, the strap, pull down and unclip. And the crampons off, but you've still got the strap threaded through. You're not having to re-thread it next time you put them on. Saves a lot of time, a lot of messing about, and it saves you getting cold fingers having to take your mitts off because you can't feel what you're doing. Alright, cheers, see you again.